What's up guys, today we got a really cool video. We're at the war room with them and we're gonna show you some never, ever, never seen before tools. So get ready, this one's good. Vim World Headquarters. Yes, sir. Tampa, this Florida, is baby. The room where the magic happens. Yes, sir. So we got some tools. Nobody except you guys here These inside this building that get a paycheck have ever seen. These are some new tools, man. So uh, I'm going to start off by saying we have a tool show coming up in which a bunch of your dealers, your tool dealers, are going to be able to see. These products, order some of them, not order some of them, because that's how new some of this stuff is. But I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek before that so you know what to order from your tool truck in the next right. coming days. So if you got a tool truck and he mentioned anything about being at a tool show, this is what he's going to look at. Yes, sir. All at right. least from them, and if you want some of it, now's the time. And now keep in mind, them. keep in mind, most of this is already on its way here. None of it's actually in stock yet. Most of it's on its way here. Some of it is going to be a little bit down the line, but all of this is available this year. So this is really a sneak peek of all this stuff that we got here. So what's cool about this video, you guys are getting to see it before your tool dealer. So you can ask your tool dealer to see it. because they will have it available to order. Back order, obviously, because it's not here, but they will be able to order it for you. So if you want to get your hands on these first, place your orders with your tool dealer. That's awesome. Let's see what you got. So I'm going to start with these guys. Okay. These right here, you have the DSPA 100 and the DSPA 200. And now what that stands for is dual swivel pinless adapter, the 100 kit and the 200 kit. Okay. The 100 kit is that satin chrome, so it's not impact, but right. you have quarter inch here, pinless, right? So swivels, oh. no problem, dual swivel. Do, do, do. Pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory, right? Cool. And then you have the 3 8 version on the same kit, right? Very nice. Nice looking kit. Part number there, so if you need anything, you got it. Pinless. Real smooth. All Very right? Nice. DSPA 100. Now, the DSPA 200, as you can see, they're in that black oxide finish because they are impact. Yep. Now, the cool thing about these guys is they, they look a little bulky. You're like, that's just a regular, like, extension, no? I was like, well, no, because you can use it as a regular fixed extension or pop it out now you have a pinless swivel here you can also pop that side out so now you have the dual swivel so now you get that extra reach or whatever it is that you actually need so you can do it like that you can have it like this or fixed there you go and you have these in quarter three eighths and half so the dspa 100 is the chrome version double swivel sockets quarter and three eighths and the DSPA 200. 200 is all three in impact. Yes, sir. So, very nice. All righty. And now down here, what you guys have asked for for a very long time, your dealers, you and your comments on our YouTube, on Clay's YouTube, on everyone's social medias, you said, guys, we want the FPRW in SAE. Mm -hmm. And ladies and gentlemen, there it is. There it is. Now, the gold ring is there to identify that it's an SAE versus a metric, metric set in your sure. toolbox. So you're not sitting here with your bad eyes looking at this mm -hmm. part number here, just identifying the S. It'll be easily identifiable with the gold ring. It's the same concept for a lot of aviation or motorcycles. This is going to be a lifesaver. Get into those really tight spaces anywhere your fingers can go. This guy can go to run things loose. It's obviously not a leverage tool. That's kind of self-explanatory, <coughs> even though a lot of you are going to be like, there's no leverage. No, obviously. But... To run stuff in and out, it's a lot easier than having your finger. You just ratchet, 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 ratchet. Yep. SA version. That's cool. One. Asked, delivered. Well, about to be delivered. <laughs> Can be ordered at least. <laughs> exactly. And now uh, in our in Clay's last video, we talked about the RFW sets, the RFW mm -hmm. 100 and the 200. Now the RFW 150 is going to be that intermediary set, which goes from 15 to 19 with no skip. So you have 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. For those of you that missed that. The way these work, and I'll show you with the bigger ones so you can see it. The way these work is that instead of biting on four flats, these ratcheting flare nut wrenches bite on all six flats. Now, a lot of people say, well, it's going to come loose over time, whatever. That's what this little notch of metal is for. 
it won't allow it to come loose because you're not relying on spring tension or this pin to keep it closed. Because as it bites, the metal is pushing on the metal and there's no expanding unless you break that notch, right. which that's that's a lot of force you're putting mm -hmm. on it there. And for a flare nut, you're not gonna need to do that. Sure. Now, the cool part about this is that since it is spring loaded, it'll lock in place like this, this little notch right there that you see, you put it on a 19 millimeter flare nut, that's gonna compress and then it's gonna actually close it itself. So it's one hand application in that sense. There you go. Now, because it's spring loaded, it's actually gonna bite going one way and then the other way it's gonna expand and ratchet for you. Mm -hmm. So it's a ratcheting flare nut wrench because it's spring loaded. And now let me see if I have something I can show you with. Which is super cool. Okay, so bites, all six flats, right? Biting, and then, so you're not worried about taking it off the fastener every mm -hmm. time you need to go back. It ratchets for you. Very nice. RFW 100, that's 14 through 19 millimeters. The RFW 100 is gonna go from eight to 14 millimeters, because this one's 15 to 19, right. sorry. And then the 200 goes from 20 up to 32 millimeters. There you go. This guy right here is a PDUJ100, and that stands for Power Drive Universal Joint 100. Mm -hmm. Now, what these are also pinless, you have a 5 16 bit holder, a quarter inch bit holder, a 3 8 square drive, and a half uh, quarter inch square drive. Very nice. All quarter inch hex, that satin chrome, bit holder, and then the square drives, obviously. That's Some a neat cool little set, set isn't right it? There. Yeah. there you Very go. Nice. PDUJ100. I mean, this right here. Cat oil filters, is that what that's for? Dave Cole filters. You got them big old oil filters. Yeah. You know how much of a pain it has it is. You know it's hard to get anything relatively big enough to get around that, mm -hmm. let alone an auto adjustable oil filter plier you that go. you don't have to keep changing. This is a very rough prototype because this is something that we're working on. It's very expensive to tool, and we have actually finally decided to bring it out. This guy, I mean, this is a monster. This yeah. thing is huge. You reach in, now you have... Is that what you get around Mike when he don't do right? Right? Or Mike, Squeeze like, him around the ears? Michael? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> we, don't, we don't do violence here. Unless you piss me off. So <laughs> what's going to be the part number for the big mumbo jumbo here? V something 100 G. I'm not positive. I'm not going to okay. lie to you. I don't know exactly. We haven't decided on a part number just yet. But I will let you know as soon as we do. I would put B A in there for big, big ass. ass. There you go. Ooh, that brings me to my... <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, a little sneak peek that's not on the table that I'll tell you about. Okay. Race day seats. RDS 1G. We sold a ton of them. You guys love sure. them. The main complaint is that some of you tool boys, like myself, are bigger set fellas. A little fluffy. So, what wrong with that? Coming soon. Big boy race day seats. Made for these big boys. Holds up to 450 pounds. That's what I'm going with. That's a big one. It got a wide old seat for our wide old ass, and it's going to be perfect. It's a lot thicker. Say it's still light. It's not as compact. It's about that thick. Yep. So it'll actually come, it'll still collapse. It's just not as small. Still pretty light, but it's for the bigger boys who wanted a little bit more support. Under. And for you guys that's wondering what they look like, right up there. Those. In the yeah, yeah. But those. except this one's going to be like a. Thicker, and it's going to be all heavy duty, heavy duty and all green, no black. There you go. Okay. So here we have our OGP 100, our Orca pliers, right? Our Orca grip pliers. You have the small guy, which is going to be the most popular one. They're auto adjusting, just like our V2400 Gs and our oil filter pliers. Okay. So they can lock in place for storage, right? And you can stick them right in your front pocket. The little guys are going to be great, five inches. We have them in seven inches and 10 inches as well. Okay. I'm going to show you on the 10 inch all the features because obviously it's easier to see. So we call them Orca grips. So you can see they're pretty thick jaw. There's four steel plates. Mm -hmm. We call them orca grips because of the serrated teeth here. You can see that on the yeah. camera. Those serrated teeth kind of look like that of an orca, do they yeah. not? Yeah. Orca grip pliers. Now, auto adjusting, like I said, so they lock in place for storage. A lot easier to store. It'll take up as much space. They have that indent right there for fasteners so that there's no slipping on them and stripping of them because you have that extra little indent there sure. to really grip on. Now, the cool part about these and why they're auto adjusting is, as you can see, Instead of biting like normal pliers, it's gonna actually, you see how the jaw on the back of it kind of went up? Mm -hmm. That's because it bites flat. It'll bite flat on something as opposed to biting clamping sure. so that you're not actually worried about stripping one side of it and not grabbing the other. Right. It's gonna bite flat like a clamp would almost. Okay. Orca grip pliers. Nice. Now this is what I would give a trophy for the, <laughs> for the best of the show here. So 
This is, is our set. newest bit set that is going to replace the PDTX100, the PDM100, and the PDIP100, which are, ex are existing and now going to be discontinued power drive sets. We'll still have the torque, so we still have them, and we'll still have them for a little bit, but this will be replacing that eventually. Now, what this is, this is, is a full power drive, which is the quarter inch hex shank bit set. Yep. You have everything from your Phillips, to your, uh, to your Torx, to your Torx Plus, to your metric hex. So all in one kit, plus the adapter for this to go on a square drive. Sure. All right? And now, what's cool about it is that we don't waste sizes with the unpopular mm -hmm. pieces and sizes that would be the normal set. For instance, the metric hex. What are the most popular sizes, Clay? Depends on what you're working on. In a, in a general Allen key, key, but in a general Allen key, what are the most worn out sizes? Probably is if it's metric, I would say four. A four. Is one of them. Well, we got a four. Definitely sure. So the two sizes of metric has we have in this set are three and four millimeter. Mm -hmm. Right there. Not only do we have them in short, we also have them in long. So three and six inch sizes. Yep. And just the three and the four. For Phillips, mm -hmm. obviously the two and the three are the most popular. Sure. You have not only one, but two number two Phillips short. Mm -hmm. And you have one three, both in short and long. And then in your Torx and Torx Plus, you're gonna go from 15 up to 30 in the Torx Plus, and you're gonna go from 10 all the way up to 30 as well in the regular Torx. And now it also does repeat a few sizes, but which makes gives you the long and the short. Sure. So you have the T25, the T20, the T15, and the T10 in the Torx, both in long and short. And then on the Torx Plus, you have the 15, 20, 25, and 27 in long and short. That's nice. This is a great set because it's always good to have those extra long ones like that. Of course. Because it seems like when you think you've got every tool you need, you know. something's going to be a little deeper. And now you got a set that'll really account for maybe three or four sets that you'd normally have sure. to buy. Like everybody's got long screwdrivers, but who the hell wants to use a screwdriver exactly. when you can right? use an <laughs> <laughs> And now look at that. You have PDMS 100, and like I said in some other videos, parts breakdowns on QR codes right there for your service trucks. Bits at a blow motor case is perfect for you. Now this is just a small taste of what we have coming. As always, we have new products and we use this little guy here to determine whether or not we're gonna keep bringing new products. Everyone says, are we bringing in new products? Vim, are you guys ever gonna stop? Let's see what this guy says. Come on. No way. <laughs> it's literally meant to... Never! Never! <laughs> That's funny. So oh, when, boy. if a guy doesn't have a tool dealer, yeah. like obviously tomorrow will be the first time tool dealers have seen this. So if they don't have a tool dealer, how long will I have to wait before they can order this from your website? So it'll be probably from tomorrow. So it'll probably be a couple weeks before we have everything up and loaded to our website because we obviously we're with the mobile dealers, we're for the mobile dealers, so they will be the first person with access to these products. Mm -hmm. I'm showing it and you will have access to it if you don't have a mobile dealer in the weeks coming, but as always, I recommend you buy from your mobile dealer. There's no service that can match it. There's no comfort of having it in your hands and seeing it before you buy it. Buy from your mobile dealers, that's what I recommend. If you don't have access to one, our website is there as well as other online retailers. Sure. But again, use our website for information and learning buy from your mobile dealer. Support the mobiles. There you go. They're there and they're there to stay. That's it. All right, guys, be sure to follow Vim's medias, his social media, his at socials, Vim tools, and Instagram, all of his TikTok, apps. and YouTube. On YouTube, we actually have a segment called Tool Tuesday, which we go over stuff like this in much shorter versions. We do about five to 12 minutes per video. And we just talk about what's going on with Vim, what's going on in the industry. And it's a chance for you, the end user, and you, the dealers, to ask us questions and you're coming directly to the source where it's me and Michael, and obviously my father is the owner of the company, so we're very, I'm, I'm close to him, you'd say, and we can talk directly without having to go through all the red tape, whereas if you sent a customer service email to another large corporation, it's gonna go up and up and up right. and up and up. It's not that. You ask me, if it's a change we see that needs to be done, it can get done very quickly. There you go. Like always, guys, be sure to thank Louie in the comments for letting us have the first look at this, because obviously, 
He could have showed this on their own channel, but he was cool enough to let us let us do this. Pulled up YouTube. Tool Tuesday. Look. <laughs> and pulled up Tool Tuesday. <laughs> Episode 42. Go check it out. So, like, it was super cool for him to let us have the first look in it. We appreciate it. So, you be sure to give him some love in the comments and go check out their stuff. Check it out. It don't cost you anything to subscribe. It's not a it subscription. Don't. It don't. You can so. check it out. If anything, we give stuff away. There you go. They, you might, you they, might win something. They pretty much pay you to <laughs> We do giveaways so, all the time. We do go. giveaways. Every month we do something. We give stuff away. There you go. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Like always, check out all of this new stuff. If you see something you like here, be sure to get a hold of your dealer. Shoot him a text at least. He may not answer. He may be having a good time with these guys because they have a lot of fun at shows. <laughs> so shoot him a text. Let him know what you're looking for. If you like the video, hit that thumbs up. Check out our merchandise. Cool tools. This guy comes down here. If you're not subscribed, take for anger. Click that button. Thank so, you, guys. Yeah. Appreciate it.